What's up, Jabo here, and today we have a new video, and it comes from TK. Now, if you guys remember last week, we did talk about a new charge that TK did have, and it was set at $10,000, and it was for having a substance or some type of item in jail that he's not supposed to have, and it was going around, and according to sources, that it was an iPad, and it was after he did an interview with Adam22, where he did say that he had an iPad in jail, and people were like, damn, that's cool. He can watch YouTube and all that other stuff on there, and everything is perfectly fine. Well, of According to a new article that was posted, they do have updated information on what really happened that day. And it says here, Take a 47, the North Texas rapper accused of carrying out a violent crime spree that left two people dead, has picked up a new felony charge after he was allegedly caught with a cell phone tucked inside his underwear while in jail. After the contraband was found, TK, whose real name is Tamor McIntyre, tried to destroy the phone by throwing it in a toilet and got into an altercation with one of the jailers, sheriff's officials told Star Telegram. And this says here, court records show prosecutors added a third degree felony charge of possessing a prohibited item inside a correctional facility last week against McIntyre, now 18 years old. McIntyre was caught with the phone on July 25th, according to Dan McClellan, chief of staff for the Tarrant County Sheriff's Office, McClellan said deputies were planning on moving McIntyre to the Lone Evans Correction Center, Tarrant County's maximum security jail, due to an early altercation that he had with another inmate. So pretty much, TK ain't letting nobody punk him out. He's in there doing his stuff. A deputy was doing a pat down of McIntyre when he felt what he suspected was a contraband near McIntyre's growing area. The item, McClellan said, turned out to be a cell phone, a charger stuffed into a white sock and tucked into McIntyre's underwear. They asked him to remove it. That's when he attempted to throw it in the toilet to destroy the phone. When they tried to take the phone away from him, he got a little angry and got into an altercation with one of our jailers. At this new detention facility, McIntyre is held alone in a solitary cell for 23 hours a day and is allowed one hour a gym. Instead of being in a group setting with other inmates with TV, you're going to be by yourself for 23 hours a day, McClellan said. Bond is the new case set at $10,000. All right, so pretty much right now take has this new charge and is now have been transferred to another part of the jail which pretty much means he's gonna be by himself for 23 hours a day it is not going to be with other inmates or be able to watch TV or anything like that because he was caught with a cell phone and he got angry and tried to destroy it by throwing it in the toilet and he also got into an altercation with one of the jailers man so take is really out here doing a bunch of crazy stuff in jail it doesn't seem to me like he cares at this point in time He's just reckless, man. He's a reckless kid. And that is it for this video. Subscribe to the channel if you are new. Hit that bell so you can be notified every time I upload a video. But yeah, I'm out.